Hi, I'm Linda, and I want to do a little video on something that maybe people would want to join in with me doing. And it's kind of like a little bit of an energy clearing, maybe meditation type of um, weight loss video. Let's work the energy to bringing in that um, more, let's call it slender, um, fit, um, lighter, healthier, happier um, energy to your body. Let's see what happens. So as I said, I'm Linda. My name is Linda Armstrong. My website is lovemylife.coach. And uh, I'm all about working with energy to bring about the life that you love, right? To bring about your desires, to clear out things that have been holding you back, that kind of stuff. So I had this inspiration to just do, I don't know, some videos. Maybe I'll, I'll do them as I'm inspired to, but maybe uh, every couple of days on something that will motivate those of us. I've gained 20 pounds, not just over COVID, but I was already up a bit before that, right? So um, I thought, well, why not have other people who feel like they're in the same boat, who aren't, haven't felt like they've been successful in letting go of the extra weight that they've gathered, <laughs> that they've collected, that they've put onto their body. Um, so let's try it, let's do it. I'm just going to connect with spirit and I'm just going to ask, you know, and, and I'm going to just do some clearings that might want to come through or any kind of inspiration or maybe some kind of process wants to come through um, as to what would assist us. Because I'm, if you're watching, I'm including you with me in uh, releasing the extra weight that you do not desire to carry around on your body. <laughs> All right. So, well, let's do this together then. Let's just take a nice deep breath. All right, and so let's slow it down. Nice, slow, deep breath in. Nice, slow, easy breath out. Breathing in that just beautiful love energy of this universe. On the out breath, just think about releasing any lower energies you've been holding on to, right? They may not even be yours. And for today specifically, we're going to we're going to release any of those thoughts and energies and feelings that you have about yourself and in regards to your weight, right? Any any of that that's like negative, that feels heavy, that you feel like you're carrying it around with you, because you know. It's all energy, right? So it might show up in some pounds, but really it's all energy. So we're just gonna imagine that as we breathe out, we're just letting go of that. Like we're just breaking, so we're gonna bring in this light and we're having this light come in so it can, it can break apart and just dissolve these lower energies that we've been carrying with us, right? Releasing any of those thoughts of, of how your body looks, how you feel in your body, all the times you put yourself down because I shouldn't have eaten that or you know, that kind of stuff that we, like all that negative self-talk to do with your body. Okay, because it's even, yeah, okay, this is what's coming through. It's more than just the weight. As you're, as you're having a negative out opinion or you're looking at your body in a negative way because of maybe the appearance of extra fat let's say the word fat let's okay so let's re, let's release all the negative energy we have around that word fat that we hold to ourselves and it sticks like glue fat yuck ugh. that kind of energy attached to that word fat can we right now just uncreate and destroy it all just let it go right And let's appreciate for ourselves that our body does require fat, right? That we need fat for a healthy body. So we don't want to hate it because then we're hating a part of us that is necessary. So, uh, all right, this is just the way it's coming through. We're just going to go with it, right? So we want to clear up all that negative connotation around the word fat, 
the word fat right now because that's a big trigger word for a lot of people, right? We want to let go, loosen up the energy around that, just letting it go, releasing it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, and as we do that, as we're releasing all these negative things we ever learned about fat, being fat, um, that other people have said through. Okay, let's do this. Let's release all the energetic, mentally, emotional ties to all of the times when you have been told you're fat, when you have told yourself you're fat, when you have felt bad for being overweight, when you have felt like you don't fit in because you're overweight. Like any of those negative connotations around your body being fat, overweight, I mean, for some people, five pounds might feel like really fat for someone, right? And then you talk to someone who maybe is 50 pounds, 100 pounds overweight, and they look at the five pound person like, you're out of your mind. You're not fat. But yet, in the mind of that person with the five pounds, they feel the very same way that person with the 100 pounds feels. Because it's all energy, right? So if we can just kind of shed all our preconceived ideas and all that has been programmed within us around um, fat, around excessive fat, around what being overweight looks like. Um, if we can let all of that go. So right now, just feel it. I could feel it leaving, right? Just feel it moving away from you. It's like, it's almost like you're just, you're shedding all those old thoughts and ideas and energy ties to all of the people, events, times when you were holding, keeping into your field, all this negative stuff around weight. Okay, let's just let it go. Let's just free ourselves. Let's start there. We're just going to free ourselves of that. And I think each time we meet, if I continue to do these, we'll just build upon the healthy, happy body, no matter what that looks like. You know, maybe someone thinks they have to, like, I, I feel I have to lose 20 pounds. I actually feel I could lose a little bit more than 20 pounds. But what I've decided to do is I'm going to let my body tell me what's right for me, right? So someone might think they have to lose 30 pounds, whereas their body might be thriving after only losing 15 pounds. And it might go into some other negative way of being by losing more. So we want to... The whole thing is let's just release any um, attachments to numbers, to weight numbers. But at the same time, okay, somebody else again, this message. So like, I know I always felt really great at 127. I don't know that that would be good for me now. I think that wouldn't be so good for me. I think maybe 137, but I'm going to let my body dictate it. But my point of this is saying that if I'm focused on more than maybe what my body would need for right now at this time in space to be thriving, that I might actually put it into detriment. And if my body thinks it's going into something that is detrimental for it, it's going to oppose it and it's not going to allow it to be. Yeah. So we want to get more in tune with what is true and right for me? So let's do that. Let's let's clear away all the old energies of deciding what the perfect weight is or how you must look. Um, because all of that is fed to us from outside, right? <laughs> Face it, it's fed. Remember, like in um, the old, olden days, in the old, these old pictures, the women are heavy and that was beautiful. Now, it's like you have to be a really skinny and that is beautiful. It's all a perception. So let's shift all of that out and tune back into our own physical body, your body. I'm going to tune into my body. You're going to tune into your body. So let's just tune into our bodies. Okay, so this is what we're going to do right now. I want you to clear your mind. We're going to ask your body what weight would be ideal. Okay. Okay, oh, I already had one pop into my head and it's not a number I wanted. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to tell you yet because oh, uh, maybe it didn't happen for you that quick. So just 
allow yourself to be open to receive from your higher self. We're asking, each of us are asking our own higher self, what would be an ideal weight for me in my body? Don't try to guess, just let something pop in. And if you feel like you're thinking too hard, I want you to just picture yourself looking beautiful. I want you to picture yourself looking beautiful right now in the weight that you are now, wearing something that really is looks great on you. Seeing your face, that smile, the glow, your energy coming through. Because when your energy comes through, it doesn't matter. Maybe it doesn't matter what your body looks like. The energy that we want to follow, that energy that is thriving, that is beautiful. Feel that energy. And while I'm talking, maybe a number pops into your head, right? We're asking your body to tell you what would be your ideal weight. And just picture yourself doing things conversing with people freely like being that really high energy where you're just bubbling over with enthusiasm about whatever the topic might be at the moment whatever you might be doing you might be food shopping you might be walking your dog you might be at a party you might be in school at a class you might be teaching a class you might be at your job you're just in some kind of in an environment feeling yourself feeling great because your body is so in tune and so your body tells you what a great weight would be for you. And just accept whatever that is. Because you can always ask again. Yeah. So I got 140. I've been targeting 137. And I'm thinking I can go a little less. But whatever. My body said 140. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to honor that. I'm going to honor that. So let's just ask the universe now that as we have received this number, this weight, this desired weight, um, let's just ask what it would feel like to just allow yourself to be that, to allow your body to easily come back into tune with that perfect weight. Let's, re let's release any energies that would block you and forbid you from hearing what your body wants, right? So when... Like you're looking at a menu maybe listen to your body what does your body want to eat like asking it you know like maybe picking up that uh, chocolate cake and asking your body do i want this do you need this do you want this and you might get a yes and you might get a no and honor that i've done that i haven't done that for a while so i'm glad this is reminding me right now um I'll, I'll ask, like, do I really need that? Do you really want that? What do you think, body? Do you want that? And then I'll get a yes or a no. You could even muscle test it, right? So maybe, I, I think I have a video on muscle testing somewhere. Maybe I'll link it to this. I must have, I know I have one. I'll, I'll find that. I'll link it to here. Um, you can muscle test it. Muscle test your body for what it wants. So, all right. So let's see what else wants to come through. So, so far we're having... We're releasing, you know, conceptions of fat. <laughs> uh, we're tuning into trusting our body, right? So let's just clear that once some once more, right? Let's re let's just release anything that will prevent you or forbid you from truly knowing and trusting in what your body is telling you, what the cells of your body are telling you that it needs. Anything that would prevent that from being an easy flowing communication for you. We now uncreate it, destroy it all, just let it go. Releasing it to the universe, sending it to the light, just dissolving it in the light and just downloading for you what it feels like to be so in tune with your body that you trust it to know what it needs. How much of whatever food is, whatever sus substance, drink it needs. Really tuning into the body. Listening to the body. Remembering the number that you received. And if you didn't receive it yet, just ask Spirit to show it to you in the next couple of days. You might be walking down the street and some number pops in your head and you're like, whoa, a license plate. Who knows? Something might come up. Someone might say something. Um, yeah. Allow the universe to tell you or to show you what your body wants you to know about the ideal weight for you. So I think I'm going to leave it at that today. Right? So... We're just clearing away. And then like maybe in the next couple of days, something comes up for you and you remember a time when someone made you feel a certain way. So right there and then when you're remembering that, just ask spirit, God, your angels, 
um, whoever you work with, Jesus, ask to have that perception released from your system. And then you can also ask to be downloaded with what is ideal for you. Just do it. It doesn't hurt, right? For me, it works. You have to find for yourself if that works. But that totally works for me. Um, so yeah, so we'll leave it at that, right? And um, work with, for the next couple of days at least, or forever, maybe you never watch another video. Uh, I will do another video in a couple of days. We'll see what wants to come through then. But for right now, we're working on trusting your body, talking to your cells of your body, asking what it wants, what it needs to be at your ideal optimal health, okay? Because that's what matters most. And then remember, every day, as often as you can, just connect to the light, fill yourself with that love, and then send it out to the world. That will assist you as well because the more light you hold the more things fall into line the more your senses and your awareness opens up to where you have that open communication with your body to where your angels send you a message it'll come so yeah all right this is fun i don't know where it's gonna go but um i'm game if you have any um suggestions of things you would want me to um do clearings for number one uh, in one of these videos or to address in some way or just something that this video stimulated within you that you would want more of whatever that is send it to me and I would uh, love to include it in next week or I don't know when I'm going to do it <laughs> a couple of days I think um, now and don't be upset if it doesn't I, I will try to include like I, what I'll do is I'll come to the video uh, with the suggestions that people had in mind. And if spirit wants to pick on any of them, it, spirit will, right? I'm just gonna follow what wants to flow during the time when I'm shooting. But I would love to have everybody else's input so that that's part of the field that I open so that we can have it hopefully be included. All right, I'll see you on another video. Uh, please like, subscribe, share this video with people you think that it could help. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.